Welcome guys to my channel and today I received very cool box actually from a guitar company that they sent me so I can make a review for you guys and this is Gitech A10 printer we are going to test print something and look how it's made how well it's made and in the box what we have in the box one two three four four pieces action so it's almost ready you get of course all tools what you need you even get mouse but that nice <laughs> that's amazing and of course all in english so it's no no problems and we, we shall begin I see some big differences between between Ender 3 printer first of all it's a plate it's a some kind of black diamond or something they call super plate yes it's a glass plate not pay sheet or similar it's really glass plate that's i like it a lot you see you can use big or a standard sd card not a micro or mini sd card of course it's a filament cooler with a duct mm. seems like a very well made actually and what more I see now also you see when you load filament this extruder system I think uh, Gitech uh, uses for all his printers and I like this filament uh, feeding hole Yeah guys, it took me about uh, 15 minutes, of course you can do much faster, but I want to check all screws, it's very most important that everything fits, it's no failure, it just like must be. I don't use a uh, spool holder, of course it comes with spool holder, I print at my own. This is I printed with uh, other printer. So I like much more this one. Because I don't like keep spool holder here. I think it's it's self printer, it's small. And with spool holder it's much bigger, it seems little strange. But it's up to you. You see that tube? Make this Teflon tube all the way down. It's absolutely the same to all printers because this tube much reach, no, reach nozzle or printer head and after that I going to use zip tight. You see what I'm doing? Yeah. Now we are ready because when printer makes moves sometimes tube goes up and makes space between nozzle or printer head and uh, teflon tube that filament came in this space and yeah and creates not so good print that's very important that we make this now we can load filament and start printer, we shall see. Yeah, seems like everything okay. Fan is working. We can check uh, repair. Pelea. Oh, yeah, Pelea one. 
and Pelea bed. We can choose Pelea. I think this is uh, just a nozzle. It's okay. And we wait until printer reach uh, 180 degrees. Oh, forward fence is working, that's great. Actually, it's very quiet, but that fan, it's absolutely the same like in uh, Ender 3. So this is a uh, glass bed, some kind of uh, black diamond or they call it super plate, Gitex super plate. And like you see, I don't using any uh, glue sticks and so on. I just printing directly the bed. We can look later around how this printer made. It's a very, very similar to Ender 3, just maybe more quiet, not maybe, actually it's more quiet, and this bed I like. Wow, first layer it comes really, really nice, and of course it's... 220, 220, and I think it's 260, so it's very, very easy to level. Just adjust these four screws. This G code pre generated, and it's a new SD card when you buy this printer, so I don't know actually what we're printing. We shall see. Seems like it's uh, too little filament. We're not going to finish that uh, print, so we're going to stop it. And I preload my own filament and print something cool. You just wait until that uh, becomes. Uh, room temperature and you just take your prints out that's amazing guys quality speaks by itself really well made really good job DTEC now I going to load my own filament and print my own this five hours later I get this I printed in uh, 150 microns, use it uh, simplified slicer, 50 millimeters per second, get a pattern printer, it's done amazing job. And if you ask me which printer I like more, Ender 3 uh, or this one, I have very simple answer for you. This printer more quiet, the axis holder stabilizer, extruder system that allows you print uh, TPO filament, and of course, Gitex Super Plate. And guys, up to you, which one you want to buy. Link below. That's my little review of uh, Gita Katem printer. Like, subscribe and happy 3D printing.